Nick Kyrgios has denied joining the growing movement against U.S. President Donald Trump after the Australian appeared to take a knee ahead of his Labour Cup match with Roger Federer on Sunday. Kyrgios knelt down for around three seconds before his pre-match warm-up with the world number two in Prague, Czech Republic, in a move that led to suggestions the 22-year-old had joined the anti-racist movement. The trend began last year when Colin Kaepernick then the quarterback for the San Francisco 49ers, refused to stand for the U.S. National Anthem star-spangled banner before games in protest at shootings of black people by white police officers. On Sunday more than 150 NFL players took a knee or sat down during the playing of the U.S. National Anthem ahead of the latest round of American football games including the match between Baltimore Ravens and Jacksonville Jaguars at London's Wembley Stadium. Kyrgios, who earlier this year courted controversy when he wore a t-shirt with the words Fuck Donald Trump to a press conference ahead of the Australian Open, though, denied his gesture was another message aimed at the U.S. president. Fuck no. Serious? Kyrgios said to journalists who asked if the move was aimed towards Trump. I'm doing that before most matches just to remember, you know, the two most important people that have passed away. Kyrgios's grandmother and grandfather died in recent years. Federer rallied to beat Kyrgios 4 to 6, 7 to 6, 6, 11 to 9 to clinch the Labour Cup for Europe. The three day competition at Prague's O2 Arena pitted a team of the best six European players against the top six from the rest of the world. Donald Trump Anthem protests nothing to do with race apostrophe 01 colon 14 seen by some as a tennis version of the Ryder Cup in golf, the inaugural Laver Cup was played on an unusual black hard court. Rafael Nadal, Alexander Zverev, Marin Silic, Dominic Thiem and Thomas Burdich also formed the European team, while Sam Quarey, John Isner, Jack Sock, Denis Shapovalov and Francis Tiafo played for the world. The tournament was set up in honor of Ron Laver, an 11 time major champion who won two calendar year Grand Slams. Chicago will host the tournament in 2018.